remember sup 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 and welcome back to the crooked man with Kira here as your host last episode we got a freaky poltergeist moment on the TV caught saying sink and blood it was really freaky so we're gonna find out what that means now said sink what was that hmm I just go to bed no TV Oh, it meant sink as in the sink. Oh, there's a scrap of paper under here. Got scrap of paper. There was a crooked man, and he walked a crooked mile. He found a crooked sixpence against a crooked style. He bought a crooked cat, which caught a crooked mouse. And they all lived together in a little crooked house. Lovely nursery rhyme. Isn't this a mother goose rhyme? Nailed it. That's completely ironic. Why is this under here? Or the sink? I guess the previous tenant? Yeah, I wouldn't say that, buddy. This is so strange. Should I? I should sleep and forget about it. That's the dumbest thing you do. You don't forget shit like that. Because the bad stuff happens. Maybe we should change our pace, huh? Guess it's not working so well. I appreciate Paul and Marion's help, but... But what? <coughs> Nothing to do with it! Is that a kid I hear? What kid would live in these be of apartments? Projects! Heck, maybe they lost. I should get checked. Hmm. Things are getting interesting. Of course, there's no kids here. Must be getting tired. Well, duh. Something break? Mm-hmm. What? Mm -hmm. back to where it was. My coffee mug! No! How dare they attack my coffee! Just a broken cup? Jeez, that starved me. Wait, what? Help me. How can you write in coffee? That's an impressive talent. God, you, you got you, you got be. This room is really, really strange. With its voices and the TV's turning on. You only have one TV, idiot. This room. Really, really strange. This boy's in the TV. What is this? Another cutscene. Another cutscene. Hello. Uh, hi, Paul. It's David. Yeah, what's up? Man, you sound sleepy. <laughs> Oop. <laughs> yeah. Um. What's up, Paul? Was up all last night. I gotta ask you something. Is it now okay? Yeah, what? You know who used to live in this room? Nah, I don't know. You asked the landlady? Curious about something? Well, it seems like you forgot a lot of stuff, but I'll ask the landlady. Sure, later. Landlady's on the far end of the first floor. I'll go see what she knows. My girl on the quest, my fellow members! Uh, I'm here this way. Nope. That's a wall. I ran into a wall, and I'm not even drunk. It's another crack. What the hell? Yes, is this a secret super club? Hello! It's Mr. Dingybod. What seems to be the matter? Good day, miss. Uh, I'm sorry, that's me. Good day, miss. I just wanted to ask something, you see. About the room I'm in. Could you tell me anything about the person who used to live there? Hmm, well, you know, these apartments always have people coming and going. Uh, what's that boy's name? I believe he was a man about your age. Certainly that's about a month ago. He lived furniture and used it for however. You wouldn't have to know where he went. Never heard that, no. 
really just up and left out of the blue. Well, that's fishy. I just can't remember the name. I can rummage through the duck, my duck, a bit to find the previous ten inches, you know, like. No, 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 that's no, no need. I just need to look curious, so thanks, I'll see you around. Alrighty, sorry it wasn't useful. At least you didn't bug me about the rat. No! Oh! Man about my age, I can only wonder. Oh well, I'll get back to my room. Dip ba do ba do ba do ba do ba do do Breaking! God damn it! Didn't take the computer. Didn't take my toilet paper. Oh, they t oh, thank God they didn't take my Sherman. My Sherman. God damn it! What what the hell is this? Oh, that's the coffee thing. What the hell? Why are these tracks on the floor? They lead up to this wall. Ugh. Is there something in this crack? Yeah, you didn't think to look a brass key? Think didn't think to look the first time? This key is pretty fancy. I doubt it's for anything in here. So I wonder why. Hmm. Cuts in. The guy's voice, the kid's voice, is the mirror writing on the TV. Turning on the coffee. Ha! It's like a poltergeist or something. Duh! You think? No shit, Sherlock. But I would have thought the landlady would mention this kind of thing. What's going on here? Maybe that's why my rent is so low. <clears throat> Not that I'd care if there were ghosts here. I wouldn't much care if they'd caught me and killed me either. Are you a frickin' emo or something, dude? Or goth? I don't know. He's, he's got a death wish. He's stupid or something. My guy is messed up in the head, he is. Somebody hit him with a mallet. But I wanna know about that scrap of paper. What was the man who lived here like? Did this stuff happen when he was here, too? Who knows? How much you used to think about it? I'll just call it a day. Back to my lovely pillows. Off to dreamland of fantasy Where I dream so happily What? What? Why? Where's that coming from? Is it from inside the house? Oh, what the hell? Um that near the toilet? Did you do it? Have it? Ah, I can't. Wow, lucky get. Really, what? Why is this in my closet? Not to mention turning on by itself. Hmm, there's something in this piece of paper here. It's an address. Our special place. Where's that supposed to be? Got a piece of paper with an address on it. Holy shit! Damn! Freaking heart attack! Waiting for you. I'm 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 waiting for you. But what? Why did? How? When did it? Who? What? When? Where? Why? And how? What? Well, that's certainly creepy as hell, my fellow members, so next, we'll see what happens in the next episode of the Crooked Man, so like a favorite if you enjoyed, subscribe, and become a member today, and I'll see you all next time on Crooked Man. Share to Facebook, Twitter, Steam, Shout, and Tout. It always helps. The support for this channel means so much to me, and I thank you all. I love all my members, and I'll see you on the next episode of the Crooked Man. This is Kira here saying, see y'all later.